Hi, I'm Denise Applegate Schober, and a wonderful feature for the crown jewel is adding the Pro Stitcher to it. And it's really important to have all the wonderful features of the Pro Stitcher. So you'll want to check the Baby Lock website periodically to see what updates have come out for your Pro Stitcher. So I'm going to go to the Baby Lock website and we're going to look at what the latest version is. It's also important for you to know you have to update each individual uh, Pro Stitcher update in order in order to get all of those features. So let's go to babylock.com for our Pro Stitcher. So I'm at babylock.com. We're here because we have a Baby Lock Pro Stitcher. We're going to go across to where it says Downloads. And once we get to Downloads, we're going to go to Software. And it's going to load the software page. With that software page, we're going to scroll through to find the latest updates. So here's Pro Stitcher, and it tells us what version it is. We're going to go all the way to the bottom of the page, and we'll find the latest and greatest update that there is. You'll need a USB stick for this upgrade or update. And with that USB stick, you want it to be empty. And we're going to place that in our computer, and we're going to download that file to the USB stick. I'm going to close the USB stick. It opens it automatically. Also, when you click download, what you're going to find are all the features that are going to be added to your Pro Stitcher. So here's the version that you'll download to the USB stick. Here's the information sheet on the update. And here is the installation information of how to update. You're going to click each of those and download. Depending on your computer, you can pick where it downloads or it'll download to a download file folder that you have set up on your computer. Once you've completed the download, do a safe eject on your USB stick and then you're going to bring it over to your Pro Stitcher. I did print the two documents that come with this update, which is great information. It tells you exactly what you're getting with that update. Also, the installation instructions. Really important, especially the first time you do this, to print these. It tells us to go to our Pro Stitcher, check the settings and about, and see which version you're on. And that way you'll have the latest and greatest. Then it tells us to shut down and exit to Windows. So you're literally shutting the Pro Stitcher down in order to get to where you need to be to update. Now you're going to put this in the USB holder. We're going to Settings. We're going to verify under Advanced what our Pro Stitcher version is. Once we do that, we can go up to Design, Touch Update. There's our update file. We can then run the update by clicking it and click Run, and it will run the update. So be sure to check all of those items, click the Start button, and be patient and wait for it to finish. You'll be able to piece, quilt, stitch something, even cut things. Maybe go to the kitchen and get some coffee. Periodically, you might check your screen in between going to get that coffee, piecing a couple quilt blocks. Now our screen says Confirm. Touch Confirm, and it will continue to copy those files. So once I confirmed, I need to agree. If you don't agree, you don't get the update. Agree, install, and now the process begins. Close, and it's extracting the files. Happy quilting with the new features of your Pro Stitcher.